This is one of several scenario comparisons between a swept spectrum analyzer such as the Agilent E4440A or PSA and the Tektronix RSA6100A with DPX. It's typical for a radar engineer to look at a radar signal initially with a spectrum analyzer, then further analyze the signal with a combination of spectrum analyzers, oscilloscopes, and other test equipment. Many radar engineers think of a spectrum analyzer as a tool of last choice because they have very tight requirements both in the frequency and time domains. They have to measure very fast, short duration signals, and a swept analyzer isn't well equipped to have high accuracy in the time domain. For the Agilent PSA, as with other traditional spectrum analyzers, these are essentially manual measurements requiring a great deal of knowledge both about the operation of the spectrum analyzer and about the signal itself. The PSA doesn't provide any automation to repeatedly measure many pulses or to observe pulse trends. The RSA6100A is designed from the ground up with the highest combination of dynamic range and capture bandwidth so it can perform measurements simultaneously in the time and frequency domains in a way that no other instrument can. It's this unique combination of RF performance, bandwidth and multi-domain analysis that makes the RSA6100A the new instrument of choice for the radar engineer. One of the key features that radar engineers love about the RSA6100A is its automated pulse measurement suite. In this application example, we've captured 290 milliseconds of a radar signal and will quickly analyze the signal with the pulse measurement suite. The upper right display shows the result summary table, which is an indispensable part of the suite. This table indexes all the captured pulses, automatically measures all the key pulse parameters that have been activated by the user, and it gives specific readouts for all pulses. The summary table is the raw data that essentially drives the other displays. The lower right display shows a time domain overview of the captured signal, and the lower left display shows the pulse view, which looks at an individual pulse from the captured signal. With pulse view, you can easily analyze many common parameters like the average on power, peak power, rise fall times, and pulse to pulse carrier phase. The upper left display shows the trend of results of a single pulse parameter for the complete pulse train. Looking at the results across the complete pulse train, or just a portion of the pulse train, enables the engineer to quickly analyze how the pulse parameters are varying over time. In the results summary table, you can select individual pulses and parameters you want to display in the pulse trace window or the pulse statistics window in order to show different trends. In this way, the RSA6100A can be used to characterize a pulse signal in a way that no other instrument has been able to do. Thank you.